Can I have my Red Bull, please? You what? That's in the kitchen, my Red Bull. Hey guys, Beautiful Tangled Mess here once again, bringing you another episode of Live Free, Dine Hard, the Vintage Edition. <laughs> Okay, so we are going to be making ham and bananas hollandaise. Looks absolutely disgusting and it is something that they apparently used to make in 1973. So we're gonna get cooking. This is one of the most disgusting recipes that I've ever seen in my entire life, so Lord help me with this. The first thing we are going to need for this recipe is six medium bananas, one fourth cup of lemon juice, and yes, I actually went to the store and bought some lemon juice. So <laughs> no more lemon juice from the gas station. <laughs> Three tablespoons of prepared mustard. I'm assuming that that's just regular yellow mustard. Two envelopes of hollandaise. Mm -hmm. Two envelopes of holiday hollandaise sauce. That is such a hard word to say. They needed to be one and a quarter ounces of pre-packaging and these are only 0.9 ounces so I got three of them so hopefully the measurements aren't yeah hopefully the measurements aren't too far off we'll just experiment with that one hold on six thin slices of boiled ham which I am assuming is pre-packaged ham slices they needed to be thin and it looks like there's enough for it I don't know this is such an old recipe and last but not least we needed a fourth cup of light cream and in my head I'm like light cream where the heck can you find light cream? So I decided to find a substitute and if you combine a half a cup of whole milk and a half a cup of evaporated milk, milk, a half a cup of whole milk and a half a cup of evaporated milk, which by the way, stinks so bad, you get light cream. So we are now going to put this recipe <laughs> together. So the first thing that we're gonna to need to do is preheat the oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Mother, can you please preheat the oven to 400 degrees? Thanks. <laughs> it says to lightly butter, since we are in the mortar days. Uh, 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 uh. I have Pam, which we are gonna put on the bottom of a two quart casserole dish. Done. We are now, <laughs> we need to peel the bananas. <laughs> we are now taking up another, so we are going to them. Did you know that you're supposed to peel bananas from the bottom? Because, oops. We're gonna lay the bananas into the pan. Oh yes, we shall keep peeling the bananas. Smile, you're on banana camera. <laughs> what? <laughs> and we peel, and we peel, and we peel bananas all day long. That's my banana song. Uh-oh, I think only one more is gonna fit. One is going to survive this onslaught. And I hate bruised bananas. All right, so hello, you have called the banana hotline. How are you today? Good. Okay, goodbye. All right, so we have our bananas in the quart pan, and we are supposed to take a half a tablespoon and sprinkle them with lemon juice so that they do not brown. I guess this is how I'm supposed to. Oh God, I think I'm doing this wrong, guys. Ew. Ew. At least it doesn't sound bad like the last recipe. I feel like this is not a very convenient way to do this. Now that we have our bananas soaked in lemon juice, supposedly, we need to spread the ham slices. We need to take the ham slices and spread them, this is so gross, with mustard. And then wrap each banana with the ham. Oh, that just sounds so disgusting. I like ham and I'm gonna be ruining all this ham. I'm a ham. You're a ham. Oh, come on. Ew, that smells like butt. You like my bracelet? Now, we are going to take our ham out of the package. And we are going to take the mustard. Squirt a little bit of mustard on the ham itself and spread it around with my little spread it until I feel like it is coated enough. Ham has mustard on it, and now we are to take our banana, ew, and wrap it up uh, <laughs> in the ham. Yay! That looks so gross! <laughs> oh, it's going into the pan like so. Now I gotta 
do it. Let's see, one, two, I have four more left to do, so I will be right back. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> the bananas are wrapped in ham. I'm gonna go put these in the oven and then we are going to make the hollandaise sauce. So I'll be right back. All right, so while those bananas and ham are cooking, we are going to make our hollandaise. Hollandaise sauce. Got our three packets here. Oh no! <laughs> I tried to be all dramatic and it didn't work. <laughs> A tablespoon of lemon juice. Ooh. I spilled. A cup of water. One fourth cup of creme. I don't even know how to use this thing. Oh. And we are gonna mix this until it is at a rapid boil. So I have my hollandaise sauce all mixed up and ready to go. It looks like banana pudding. Oh, it's too, I think it's too thick. Okay, now it's starting to look like the picture at least. I did a good job of representation this time, unlike the other one. This. I don't know, it's a weird smell because it kind of smells good this time, but I don't know if this combination is gonna be good. So here it is, everybody. Ta-da. It's got the uh, hollandaise sauce on it and everything, and now, ew, it's got so much water in it. It's going back in the oven for another five minutes, and then after that, we are gonna do a taste test. Ta-da. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We are ready for the taste test, and today's guest is my lovely mother. If you couldn't tell already, we look a lot. Ta-da! What do you think? You think we did a good job? Do we need a slow-mo shot of this? Oh, that was hilarious. I'm going to serve my mother one banana. <laughs> One banana. Oh, really? I had a big wave of nausea. <laughs> I'm scared. One serving of banana hollandaise. <laughs> oh my god. This is, I'm very uncomfortable with this situation it's right just, now. How big is your piece? Just, oh my god. <laughs> I may have made it bigger, too big of a piece. Alright. Doesn't feel right. I'm gonna eat okay, it. ready? No. Here's a bite. Mm. Live free, die hard, everybody. Cheers. Oh my god. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. Nope. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, it's doing the awful. same thing again. It tastes like vomit. It really does. Oh, it really does. It like really the pre vomit does. that comes out before the actual vomit. Yeah. Like yeah. when you burp and the vomit's yeah, stuck yeah, in your yeah. throat. Yeah. Oh, now I'm really gonna throw <laughs> Yeah, that's not good. A lot of different flavors going on in this dish. Let me taste the hollandaise sauce real quick. Okay. Mmm. Something. That's not. <laughs> I know. That was definitely a, a thumbs down for me. I am definitely never ever recreating that disgusting recipe again. Way too many different flavors that just did not, it was like the flavors were there, but they didn't combine. No. So it was just like your palate was just like of different flavors that no. don't mix, if that makes no. any sense whatsoever. Disgusting. But I am gonna put the recipe in the description below. <laughs> I'm gonna put the recipe in the description below, so if you guys try this recipe, please send me a picture and let me know what you think. You can send the picture on Instagram or Facebook or even Twitter and let me know what you think. This is disgusting. I feel like burping again yeah. and just the lemon juice. I think I put too much lemon juice on the bananas, but the bananas weren't supposed to brown. Don't make me get sick. Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching the second episode of this Live Free Die Hard Vintage Edition of Beautiful Thing About Us. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and a comment down below and tell me what you think. And if you have any suggestions for any other foods that you would like me to try on Live Free Die Hard, let me know, please. You can also follow me on my social media pages, which will be in the description below. I have Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat. Always remember, guys, that life is a beautiful tangled mess. It is our job to 
to make the most out of what we have been dealt with in life and make it the best time of our lives. You guys are awesome, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Bye, 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 bye.